All right, what's up, everybody? Our first live streaming of the baseball league. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Ought to be a good one here between the Cincinnati Reds and the Houston Astros. Settling in now, Jesse Winker, oh, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. And this one's nowhere close as that bounces to the plate for ball one. And back-to-back -back pitches out of the zone to begin the evening. It's 2-0 now. Now the pitch. Temperature 86 degrees here tonight as we get this one started. Winker in front, three balls and a strike. Finally got one over. Nothing worse than starting the game with a four-pitch walk. And now look out as Ed runs in and gets him. And a very interesting start to this one. Standing in, Nicholas Castellanos. First pitch coming, here it is. And that's by him, it's 0-1. One thing I'm going to keep my eye on with this young starter on the mound is how he's able to stay ahead of hitters. It makes pitching it. Oh, and he misses it. And that <laughs> runner will go miss. no further than second as there are two <laughs> aboard now. That is third. Yeah. Second base. Into the box, Mike Mustakis. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. Great chance to drive in a run here in the early going. Even one and one count to Mustakis. Hey, I know it's early and we're in the first right here. But he's going to have to work that heater to both sides of the plate. He cannot get away with missing over the heart of the plate all night. And this one's in the dirt. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. Winker at second. Castellanos on at first with nobody out. This is pulled into right. And Alvarez will be there for the first down. He is in there. Runners on the corners now with one man gone. And into the batter's box next, a guy who's developed into one of the big time power hitters in the league, a Eugenio Suarez. So a rather weak start to the at bat as he misses badly there. It's 0 and 1. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Couldn't be a whole lot better situation to hit in now. Three and one, two on. He's got to be thinking he's going to get a pitch he can drive right here. The three-two pitch. And there's ball four as this one gets away a bit. Bases are loaded here with one away. And standing in is the on-base machine, first baseman Joey Votto. And a ball, 1-0. Bases are loaded with only one out. 
fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. There's certain pitches throughout the game that decide whether you win or lose it. This in the dirt and block behind the plate. Fortunately, no advance from any runner, but meanwhile, it's 3 0. And that misses. Ball four. A run will come in to score. Ready now for Cincinnati, Aristides Aquino. And now the Reds look to push more across the plate in the opening frame. And it's fouled away. The 0 and 1 delivery. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Pitch in the dirt, and that gets away. And he is safe at the plate as he wasn't able to recover in time. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Catch is made in medium deep left center. Here comes the runner for the plate. <laughs> and he'll make it into score. It's a sack oh, fly it and an so RBI, old. and it's now a 3 nothing ball game. Stepping in, Freddie Galvis. Another first inning RBI opportunity for him here. And this pitch just about saws him off as he can't get extended at all. That's strike one. I think this inning could have far reaching effects in this game. They're really making him work, and unless he dials it in, it's probably going to limit how deep he goes into this game. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. I like that he tried. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that Thank will you, retire. Here's George Springer. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The center fielder, George Springer. And the pitch. Way behind that pitch, it's 0 and 1. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0-2. This hitter right now looks overmatched with a fastball. I think you go right back to it. Close there, but he doesn't get the call with the breaking ball. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. So the base is empty here with one away, and that'll bring in Jose Altuve. Not even close on that swing. No balls in the strike. Bases are empty. One man out. And boy, this at no, bat is not on, starting man. off well as he's behind 0-2 now. Not much he could do with that one. Tied him up in knots. Lifted down the line and right and back out of play. Count holds it 0-2. Back to back strikeouts in the first right here. Pitcher is setting a tone pound in the zone. Good waste pitch, one and two. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Here's Michael Brantley. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. A ball and no strikes. Just missed with that heater, but even if he wanted to swing, I don't think he could have caught up to that one. 2-0 to Brantley. Now the 2-0. Two out, nobody on. Oh, he just threw that fastball by him. He's one pitch away from striking out the side, but even more than that, to throw a donut up after your offense put up some runs, I can't tell you what that means to the boys in the dugout. Alex Bregman would be next. Struck him out, so he makes quick work of him here. Three straight strikeouts, and the side is retired.
Now at the play, Tucker Barnhart. Yes, he'll get his first opportunity in this one. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. And this one's not close. It's in the dirt for ball one. And 2-0 and as this one's taken low. This at bat sets up really good right here, right? Hasn't seen a fastball yet, but now he gets to count at two balls and no strikes. He has to be looking for a fastball right here. A little early, and now it's even at 2-2. Two and two. And now pitch on the way. And he tried to hold up that time. We'll get an appeal down to third and no swing. It's ball three. Now the payoff pitch home. Rounded softly down the line toward first. Throw to first will be in time and there's one gone here to start the second. So one away here with the bases empty and digging into hit next. It'll be the pitcher Luis Castillo. Here's the first pitch to him. The one one. Taken strike two. One out, nobody on. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out, and it's two up, two Terrible down man. to start the second. Number 33. So it's back to the top Jesse. of the order now. And next to bat will be Jesse Winker. Now a change up here to start things out, but that'll dip a bit too low, and it's one and zero. Kind of a surprise not to see a fastball in the first pitch there. The guy's probably taking at least one pitch to give his pitcher a chance to sit down after he already made the second out. Swing and a liner. And that'll get down for a two out single. The left field, two. Nick, Castellanos. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. A base hit in his first trip. Count is even one and one to Nicholas Castellanos. One ball, one strike. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Springer giving chase. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Cannot hit. One of the best hitting teams. Bottom of the inning ball. now. At the plate, Alex Bregman. He'll get to take his first cuts here. The third baseman. Pitch on the way. Alex Bregman. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. Now here's the pitch. Fouled off. Early, late, early, late, early, late, early, late. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first out. Stepping up now, Jordan Alvarez. Alvarez. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Now the fastball is swung on and missed. What I love right there is just the freedom in that hack. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. A swinging oh strike, and now it's 0 2. How am I not hitting Bases this? are empty, one man out. And this will be lined into center field, and they've got themselves their first hit of the ball game. Cannot hit this game. So next to swing the bat will be Carlos Correa as he'll come up empty there as he misses the off speed pitch for strike one. Late decision to swing that time and as a result it's 0 and 2. Kind of lag is getting me. Hoping to send him packing pitch on its way. And this is swung on and missed his fifth Why strikeout already. And there are two gone in the inning. So a runner at first with two away. And digging into bat next, the Cuban import Yuli Gurriel. Swing and a flare hit toward right. In there, a base hit. 
And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. In now, Martin Maldonado. And there's a swing and a miss at an off speed pitch to start him out. Nothing in one. Two's all over the place. Two on, two out, and of course, here in inning number two. Count now a ball and a strike. Here's the 1 1. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chasing. You have to set your sights a little bit lower and control the strike zone. And the throw to first will indeed get him. It's a strikeout score at two to three, and the inning is over. Ready for another chance? Mike Mustakis, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Open stance by Mustakis, and now the pitch. Nope. Count one and oh. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Hard ground ball, defense played him perfectly, and Mustakis is aboard. It's a base hit. To the plate now, Eugenio Suarez. As he'll look at a changeup that drops below the knees for ball one. He drew a base on balls his first time up. Here's a swing and a miss, one and one. A runner at first with no outs here. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. In is Joey Votto now. The first baseman, number 19. Joey Here's the first pitch to him. Good change up there to start him, but it drops a little low for ball one. You can really tell about how effective this guy's going to be when guys are swinging at that changeup. So far in this one, they've been real smart to let it go. And that's in there. Base hit. Now that number 44. Standing in now, Aristides Aquino. He offers at it and sends a bouncer out to short. Altuve for one. But he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. The Striding into the box, Freddie Galvis. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few ABs where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. Hey, the way this guy on the mound's been struggling to find the zone, I'm not mad at the guy taking the pitch. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Into the box now, Jose Urquidy. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Great job by the pitcher right there to pull the string. He knew he had an aggressive hitter at the plate, somebody who was sitting on fastball and ready to do damage, and he was able to slow him down right there and get him off balance. A ball and two strikes to the Astros pitcher. Well, facing an AL pitcher at the plate, you certainly don't want to waste too many bullets on him. I expect this next pitch to be grooved right down the middle. The one-two. Is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that brings in George Springer. Clearly off with his timing on that one. A swinging strike. Swing and a miss on the slider. And he's quickly behind. Nothing in two. Springer brings a ton of pop to the plate with him. Particularly against right handed pitching. Some guys don't drive the ball as well when facing a pitcher who throws from the same side that they swing the bat, but that's certainly not the case here. Yeah, this guy just absolutely hammers right-handed pitching. You know, some guys like the ball in, coming towards them, and that's exactly what the righty-on-righty -righty matchup presents itself. A two-seamer in, a four-seamer that leaks out over the plate, a hanging breaking ball. This guy seems to absolutely hammer those. Hey, with two outs in the number two hole, you're just trying to get on. You got the big boys coming up behind you. 
Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. Number 44 is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Ready now, Tucker Barnhart. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. The catcher, Tucker Barnhart. First offering on its way. And he takes ball one. One and one to Tucker Barnhart. You know, you think it's an eight hole hitter right there. You shouldn't be taking that fastball, and you're right. But when you got the pitcher hitting behind you, you sometimes sit off speed because that's the pitch you're usually going to get. The pitcher does not want to get beat by you, and he's not afraid to walk you and hand it over to an AB against the pitcher. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. So here's the Reds pitcher, Luis Castillo. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Pitch on the way. Hit to first. Guriel brings it in, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Ready once again, Jesse Winker. He singled his last time up. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Change up a little bit inside. One and oh. And right into the shift. Altuve fields it cleanly. On to the first baseman, Guriel, and that will end the inning. And here's the left handed hitting Michael Brantley looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this AB. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Weak grounder back to the mound. He's got it. And there's one down now. So the base is empty here with one away. And that'll bring up the LSU product, Alex Bregman. First delivery to him on the way. Fouled away. No runs, two hits, no errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. Counts even one and one to Alex Bregman. Swing and a line drive. Foul. Hit hard to third. And in the left field for a one out hit. Now in the box, Jordan Alvarez. He reached on a single in his first try. Alvarez. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Oh, had him chopping at that one. It's nothing in one. In today's game, with velocity and exploding breaking stuff, you have to find a way to control the strike zone as a unit. They haven't been able to do that today, swinging at way too many pitches outside the zone. Line fouled off to the left and a few rows back. Runners on first with one down. And another foul ball. And he punches out another one, make it nine for the ball game. So a runner at first here with two gone in the inning. And the former number one overall pick in American League Rookie of the Year, Carlos Correa, bats next. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready, or he's going to throw it right by you. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ball game, and the inning is over. Nick Castellanos now. He's one for two in the ball game. The left Nick Castellanos.
ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. A hey, pretty aggressive pitch right there up in the zone. Surprised he didn't offer at it. Back up the middle. There is Altuve. And the fifth He's inning up. will start with a ground out, one away. So one away here with the bases empty. And up next, the former World Series hero, Mike Moustakas. Hit hard, but right into the shift. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Now batting, Eugenio Suarez. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. First pitch coming, here it is. Three runs, four hits. One error on the ledger for Cincinnati so far. 0 and 2, the count to Suarez. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. Maldonado has it. So after the misplay following the strikeout, Suarez reaches on the error after the strikeout. Digging in, Joey Votto. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. Lifted in the air out towards left center. And Brantley will make the catch, and that ends the inning. Stepping in, Yuli Gu. Leading off for the Astros, the first baseman, Yuli Esky. And the pitch. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And a diving effort there, but it'll come up empty. It's a base hit. Into the box now, Martin Maldonado. There's a two seam fastball that's fought off foul off to the right. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Boy, that's just about in the catcher's glove there. It's 0-2. Here we go. And oh, this one's by him to the backstop. And he is in there. They couldn't get him at second. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Kyle Tucker will get a chance with the runner in scoring position here as he'll pinch hit now with one away. Swing and a miss as he was way in front of that one. One out and a runner on second base. A bouncer to the left side. And that's the second out. So the batting order turns over now and set to go George Springer. He was sent packing on strikes in his last trip. Boy, not the way he wanted to start out here. It's 0-1. That's been a great pitch for him all night. Able to push him, pull the throttle a little bit, throwing a uh, just a sec now as that ball finds its way into the outfield, a base hit. And they are on the board as the run scores from second to narrow the gap to 3-1 now. Now back. So up to the plate next would be Jose Altuve as it's grounded sharply to first. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. Two men on, two out, and Michael Brantley settles in to hit at the plate. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Hits are now even at four apiece. Sent on the ground out to second. Mustakis is there. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. Austin Pruitt takes over to start the sixth now inning on the mound. In now for the Reds, Aristides Aquino, and he'll lead things off in the Cincinnati sixth. 
first pitch coming. Here it is. Nearly got the inside, but ruled the ball. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Down low, and the plot thickens here. Three and oh. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Three and one the count now. Tough pitch to lay off, but he did, and it's ball four, so the leadoff hitter is aboard to start the set. Stepping into the box, Freddie Galvis. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. The swing, and this ball is blasted to right field. Nothing's going to keep this one in the ballpark. And out of here, and I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Now better. Stepping in now, Tucker Barnhart. Barnhart. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. No hits to this point. Got him out on his front foot there as it swung on and missed for strike one. The 1-1. One -one. Ground ball right into the shift. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Now batting. The pitcher. Louis Castillo. So now to the plate, Luis Castillo. In the dirt here. And a nice job keeping it close. It's ball one. The 1 0 home is going to be a sacrifice attempt as he gets it down. And they'll put the tag on him going to first, but the sacrifice is successful. So coming to the plate, Jesse Winker, a hit in two tries so far. He's set. Here it comes. And this one's in the dirt. And no advance. It's ball one. Still only one out in the inning. Red center fielder in front with a 2 0 count. Well, he's not proving that he can command his breaking ball in the zone right now. And until he does, there's no reason to bite on it. Oh, and ouch. That one drilled him. Oh, and he overshoots his first baseman as it's over his head. And now this ball's going to wind up out of play. And that'll compound matters even further. In now, Nicholas Castellanos. As he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. Drilled right back up the middle. And that'll get by into center field for a base hit. And they won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one away. At the plate now, Mike Mustakis. He swings and grounds it to short. Step on the bag for one. Over to Guriel for an inning ending double play. And that'll bring up Alex Bregman. He'll lead it off as we start the home sixth. Here's the first pitch to him. Ball one as the changeup misses well off the inside. Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. The one one. Swinging bunt out in front of the plate. Throw to first is in time for the first down. So stepping in, Jordan Alvarez. A hit in two tries for him so far. Alvarez. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. One out, nobody on. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Here's Carlos Correa now. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Swing and a miss, but he's right on here. One strike. 
Hey, the guy on the mound is absolutely pounding the zone, and that's why he's been able to stay and pitch deep into this game. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Number 44 has to retreat to the track, but he has it to retire the side. Digging in once again, Eugenio Suarez. Over two with a walk for him so far. Eugenio Here's the first pitch to him. A ball and no strikes. Popped him up. Guriel is there. Makes the play one away. So up steps the former MVP Joey Votto. Joey Votto. First pitch on its way. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. Bases are empty, one man out. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. High in the air out to center field. Springer has a read on it. Two gone. At the plate, Aristides Aquino. Now the pitch. And this is cut on and missed below the knees, and it's 0-1. And he fouls this one off. Bases are empty here with two men out. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now the Cuban import, Yuli Gurriel. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Not his best effort that time at strike one. And I really don't know how you swing at that. He must have had his mind up. He was going to swing as soon as the ball came out of the pitcher's hand. Hard stuff on the corner, and he's got him 0 and 2 now. Nothing in two count, and the pitch stays alive, still 0 and 2. Now here's the pitch. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. Up with it, Barnhart. And he makes the throw to first. Guriel is retired, and there's one away. Now at the plate, Martin Maldonado. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matty. Got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way to make this pitcher work a little bit harder. Behind 0-2 now. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. Next to hit will be the pitcher, number 51. He's newly entered into the ball game, so this will be his first trip to the plate here in inning number seven. A low the zone, a swing and a miss. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Hey, this guy obviously feels he can move traffic right here. He's taking two. A swing and a miss. That retires the side. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Freddie Galvis. He'll have the first crack at it here as we start inning number eight. Yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Right fielder looking up. Gone to lead off the inning. Now batting. Into the box, Tucker, Tucker Barnhart. Barnhart. He offers at it and sends a bouncer out to short. And this will ricochet off of him on the mound. But he is able to recover as he gets the out at first. One away now. Yeah. 
your attention, please. Pink hitting for the red. Number 31, Travis Jankowski. Right through it here, and he's behind 0-1. One. One. one run in and one gone so far this inning. Line drive to center field. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. So a base hit from the pinch hitter will send them back to the top of the order with one away in the now inning. The center fielder, Jesse Winker. To the plate now, Jesse Winker. Lined into right, a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. The left fielder, number two. Yeah. Stepping in now, Castellanos. Nicholas Castellanos. As he'll go after a curveball out of the zone to start the at bat. It's 0 and 1. Two hits in four attempts to this point. And a check swing here, but he pretty clearly broke the plane, and it's 0 and 2 now. From the belt, kicks and deals. Takes this the other way to right, and that's in there. Base hit. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet, but the bases are loaded with one away. Standing in now, Mike Mustakis. As he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. Open stance by Mustakis, and now the pitch. Hit in the air out to center field. On the move is Springer. He gets there to make the catch, but this should bring home a run as the runner tags from third. And now Gracious just getting the ball back into the infield is becoming a problem. And now they'll get the third out here, but it won't come until the run has already crossed the plate on the play, and the inning will draw to a close. Next up for the Strohs, George Springer. Leading He's working on the Astros, the center fielder, George Springer. First pitch of the at bat. Belted high and deep into right center. A ball that's carrying. And this one will bounce into the wall. Around second now, and this ball still hasn't been fielded. And he will make it all the way to third now as that mistake proves a costly one indeed. Up next to the Astro, the second baseman, Jose Altuve. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. As he can't catch up on a fastball at the letters, and it's strike one. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. A swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. Hey, I thought he was going to work around them right here in this situation. But after getting two swinging strikes, there's a change of game plan. I guarantee he's going right after him. So he chased out of the strike zone on that one. Jose Altuve becomes the first out in the bottom of the eighth inning. Hit down the third baseline. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. He's set. Here's the 0 1. Late decision to swing that time, and as a result, it's 0 and 2. His heater's got some late ride through the zone. A lot of late swings right now. You're only going to get to that pitch if you get the front foot down early. The next 0 2. Grounded back up the middle, fielded by Mustakis. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. Third Next will be the cleanup two. hitter, Alex Bregman. Alex. He'll try and start things Bregman. over now with the bases empty and two away following the RBI ground ball. Hard on the ground towards short, and that's through for a hit. So now to the plate, Jordan Alvarez. As he'll come up empty that time on a sinker at strike one. Swing and a miss on the slider, and he's quickly behind, nothing in two. 
Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put in. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Eugenio Suarez. He'll be charged with trying to get on board. Eugenio Amber Valdez enters now in a mop-up role as she'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. Number 59. First offering on its way. And it's fouled away. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. Name it a game out on the mound is to disrupt timing of the hitters in the box. He certainly got this guy on the defensive. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Swung on and missed. That's strike two. The shift will be of little importance here as this is lifted in the air out to left field. Correa will stay with it as he backs up and puts it away. One gone. The Digging in to try it again. 19. Joey Votto. Joey he flew Votto. out in his last Votto. at bat. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Oh, and that misses there. ball one. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And no one will get this one. The 1-1 one, one home. Swing and a line drive. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. The batter, number 44. In now, Aristides Aquino fouled off. 0 for 2 for him to this point. A 1 pitch on its way. Fouled away. Filthy change up that time, but he's able to make contact and he'll get another chance. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch. Two away. Digging in and looking for more. Freddie Galvis. He's gone deep twice in the game, making him two for four. Here comes the first pitch. Fastball in there for a called strike. Two out with the man at first. And look out as that fastball ran in and got him. Ouch, Brand. Standing in, Tucker Barnhart. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Love the fact that he's not scared to go right back inside with another fastball. I know he hit the last guy, but if he's going to have success, he's got to establish that pitch in. Slap hard the opposite way. That's in there. Base hit. And a good throw will wind up holding that runner at third, so the bases become loaded now with two gone. To the red. Number 15. Tried to check it and it's 0 and 1. Senzel, just 24 years of age. He's in his rookie year here at the big league level. Crowds him a bit with a fastball there and it's to 1 and 1. Looking to wiggle out of this. Here it is. High in the air out towards shallow right. Alvarez is there as he makes the catch and they'll tightrope out of danger. Ball set for the bottom of the ninth. So striding forward now, Carlos Correa. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. And a fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Here we go. 
Swing and a miss one as he one. ramps up on the fastball. One and one. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. Early fast, early fast, early late, early late. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. So here's Yuli Gurriel. He's two for three thus far. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A little roller toward the hole. Scooped up. And he is out on the tag. In now, Martin Maldonado. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Maldonado. Here's the first pitch to him. Ground ball left side. Galvis on the slide. He gathers the throw. What a play. And just like that, this one is over. Okay. Eight to two tonight's final. Cincinnati jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Luis can.